What's going on guys? Today we have the first headline play review. It is Pepe coming next. <laughs> So we have Pepe Headliner 87 rated. It's practically a one to watch card, but the promo looks absolutely incredible. And as you can tell, I did pack this card, which is amazing. He's come from a 75 non rated uh, gold player to a first in form, a second in form, and a third in form that stands at 86. And then obviously with these headliners, he has gone up to 87 right mid. He's looking at around about 150, 160k on both consoles, and he looks incredible. Uh, he's got four star uh, skill moves, three star weak foot, left footed, six foot, high attacking work rate, medium defensive work rate. In game, he has 2,181 in game stats. Obviously, this could go up as well with him being quite in form. Can he get a fourth in form? Uh, maybe go up to an 88 or an 89, depending on how much they want to give him. Obviously, the first in form went up by six, then by three, and then by two. So. I, I could imagine if he's going to get a 4th in form, it'll only be an 87, um, and then this should go up to an 88 from that. So looking at some in-game stats, we have 91 pace on this card, 95 acceleration, 87 sprint speed. He has 91 attacking position, 88 finishing, 94 shot power, 85 long shots. Uh, he's got 83 stamina with 83 jumping, 99 agility with 83 balance and 86 uh, what's that? Oh, re reactions, ball control, and dribbling, all that. And then 81 composure. He does have some really nice passing as well with 87 vision, 85 crossing, 82 free kick accuracy, 83 short pass, and 97 curves. So pre-patch, this card would have been banging in finesse shots everywhere. I still think they're still there. I don't think they're kind of gone, but they're not as overpowered. I find that you've got to kind of play the ball up a bit more um, in, in the game now after patch. Uh, but this card does it fantastically. Uh, in general, pace-wise is always always nice. He's got 91. Um, he's got lovely shooting, lovely passing, lovely dribbling. Personally, I'd definitely put this card as a, a right striker. Obviously, he's got that left foot with four star uh, with three-star weak foot. So probably just cutting in more than anything uh, really the right foot is there. I don't think... I think a four-star is what I like. Then I'd probably be more comfortable making shots with it. But his left foot is an absolute nut. It is incredible. The pace on this card, obviously, is fantastic. Um, physicality of him, I didn't really see too much wrong with him. He is a bit skinny, almost, but really tall. Um, so he does manage to get the ball quite a bit. Um, I think, well, he's got 68 strength. So if you were going for maybe a finisher card, which would kind of... What would it actually give you? Let's just have a look. Uh, where's the finishing? We have got it. I, I can't even see it. Where, there it is. So you'd get practically 95 shooting, and you'd get 5 extra strength, 10 extra aggression. So to be honest... And you get 93 jumping, so that's really nice. Obviously, the pace doesn't really need to be touched as much. Dribbling-wise, is pretty solid. And passing again, if you play him as a right wing or a striker, um, he's already got really nice stats all over. So, I really enjoyed this card. Obviously, I did pack him, so he was bound to be first. I've played with a few others as well, um, definitely coming very soon. Um, I think we've got Anatovic, Rashford, and... I think I've played with Dembele as well, I'm currently on. So, there's plenty coming out. I'm going to hopefully try and do every single one. Pogba's the only one that I'm thinking is a lot of money. Look, standing at around about 2 mil at the minute, so we'll see. But, overall rating for this card, I'm giving him a 9. I think he's absolutely incredible. And if he does manage to get any informs, I think he's going to do it even better. And I don't, know if, I don't think Team of the Season will be part of this, but... If it is, oh my, this card's going to be incredible. Love the design. Think he's absolutely fantastic. I haven't played with any of his other informs, um, which I'm really shocked at. I was planning on doing his 86, but didn't manage to get around to it. But I'm glad this has come out. So hopefully you enjoyed the video. Let me know down below, have you used any version of this card? Obviously, he is up against the, the kind of Mbappes and the Lee Guns. Um, hasn't really got many Ivory Coast links, but we'll see how it goes. So let me know down below what you think. Did you like this video? Make sure you give it a big like. Subscribe for more content, for more headliners coming very soon. And I'll see you all again next time.